Welcome to Household Wizardry, where we make things out of items we have laying around the house. This time around, we're going to be making a chemical reaction no heat lava lamp out of just oil, water, food coloring, and Alka Seltzer. What you will need for your no heat lava lamp is an empty bottle, glass, or container, food coloring, vegetable oil, effervescent tablets, and water. With your clean empty bottle, the first thing you're going to want to add is some water. So add about three to four centimeters of water. Doesn't have to be perfectly measured, just about that much. Next, you're going to add the vegetable oil. Tilt it and slowly pour it. Fill up the entire bottle with oil. Tilting it so it goes in a little slower. Like that. Next, you're going to take your food coloring and add 15 to 20 drops of that. Now you're ready for your Alka-Seltzer effervescent tablet. You can break one in half, drop it in, and watch the reaction. and drop another one in for some added bubbles. So what's happening here? Why doesn't the oil like to mix with the water? So water is made out of H2O, one oxygen atom with two hydrogen atoms attached. It's called a polar molecule because one side is positively charged, the other side is negatively charged. These kind of molecules like to stick together a lot. The oil is made out of carbon and hydrogen atoms in a molecule called a hydrocarbon chain. These kind of molecules are nonpolar, which means their charge is really spread out and they do not like to stick together strongly. They stick together very weakly and they're called hydrophobic, which means they're afraid of water. They are not attracted to water because of their charge. So the nonpolar molecules stick together and the polar molecules stick together and they just don't mix. Then we add in the Alka-Seltzer, which releases carbon dioxide, which is one carbon atom and two oxygen atoms in one molecule. These molecules rise to the surface and bring with it the dye in the colored uh, food coloring. 
and then they pop and then the food coloring goes back down and it restarts the cycle again. To customize your lava lamp, you can put a light behind it or put objects in it like glitter or stuff like that to finish the lava lamp effect. Thanks for watching our video and check out more Household Wizardry videos on this channel.